What's up everybody? It's Kaze from iCaz Media. So yo, today it's Christmas. And you don't know the whole heap of Christmas movie them way. But once you see them movie they are going on your TV, you just can't pass it. You know the movie there? Well if you don't know, that we're gonna talk about today. So welcome to No Watching. Uh, the first movie we're gonna talk about friends, see that movie there, you know a Christmas. If you wake up from under a rock and you see that movie there on your TV, a Christmas. Because trust me, so the first movie is Home Alone. Christmas without a Home Alone movie. You know Home Alone stars Macaulay Culkin, Arson, however I'm name pronounced, you know me have a butcher it because Jamaicans don't pronounce nothing like everybody else in the world. So, just see with me. Anytime you come to names, now we get it right. Just probably now we get it right. So we have Joe Pesci as one of the teeth then. You know the man that was nice of the whole movie. Home Alone, Christmas movie, can't resist that. Right. See Home Alone, what do I say? Ah, Christmas. Next movie on the list is Friday After Next. Hey, take your ass back downstairs, cause you ain't evicted nobody. nobody. Unless you got a motherfucking army with you. What? I don't need no army, Mr. Smart Ass. My son Damon home da right now. Damon? I had a nightmare about that fool last night. Data. Craig. Which one of you bitches want to watch my draws tonight? Oh, that'll be him. Yeah. Now, the first Friday with Chris Tucker, that shit. I don't think them can ever beat that one there. But the second one, still it good. The second one was Friday after next. If I remember correctly, this might be the third one, but I have to go check, which I'm not going to know. I'm not going to script and do it half of my head. Friday after next takes place near Christmas time. You have Cat Williams. Wait a minute, let me put some pimps in there. <laughs> He's funny looking, huh? I don't know, why he dressed like this? How are you? Doesn't matter. Get the trunk. <laughs> Ice Cube, yeah, that was Ice Cube, and Mike Epps. Yo, know, everybody in that movie just made the whole movie good. Friday After Next is just one of the movies there where you can sit down with your friend, then no matter how much time you watch it, I still have a laugh, I still have a find it funny. And next one on the list is Gremlins. Gremlins, once I see that are gone, I'll stop and watch it. And you know, at Christmas. Not even know if them still, not even know if them still bring it on TV, but every Christmas, me, I go download it myself. You have Gremlins 1 and 2. For a long while, I didn't forget about Gremlins 1. But just number one, nothing about that movie. It takes place in a small town where the Gremlins then just take over and mash up the whole place. But that was not the one that me remember. I remember Gremlins 2. Everything took place in this building in New York. And then take over and mash the place. That's how Gremlins do. Just a bunch of troublesome fitting. I just saw them there. Gremlins are one of them movies there where you and your friend them can sit down, watch, laugh. That one of these creatures is somehow able to talk and he's going to talk with us right now. I think the main question that people have is, the creature, what is it that you want? 
Civilization, yes. The Geneva Convention, chamber music, Susan Sontag. Everything your society has worked so hard to accomplish over the centuries, that's what we aspire to. We want to be civilized. I mean, you take a look at this trail here. <laughs> now, was that civilized? No, clearly not. The need to remix Grimblades. That's all Hollywood do know I did, so. And by now, of us. So, just remake Grimblades. Alright? So, we mentioned Home Alone at the first part of this, but I forgot to mention the new one that come out this year Home Sweet Home Alone. Now, you can watch it one time with your friend, them, but it never live up to the hype of the first three movies. Them. So, this time you have some parents who are trying to get in our house because. One little pitney, one little brat. But you hate the pitney. I like the movie make you do it. Just hate him. It just seem like at least Macaulay Culkin you did like him. You know, he feels sorry for himself and get left home by himself. But this pitney, he deserves to get left by himself. He just. Anyway, movie that shit. So, uh, we're moving on. The movie come out in the December one might want to check out and I think they might go be December movies but yeah when I have to go check out the movie yeah. and it's supposed to do a video for Bruised Bruised is a Halle Berry movie Halle Berry starred and directed but I don't know like I said maybe just lazy it's birth certificate that stuff it's pretty straightforward how oh, you know all that you got a kid. Alright, so bruised. Bruised did make my sit down and like your nose not. And I'm on top of my ball for bruised. But Halle Berry, she get in shape for this movie and yo, it was a good movie. So yeah, I'm gonna check out bruised. Cats. I have to stop my video for the post them where I knock on my door and I tell myself they want to come in the house and come in my room. Yo, I don't even remember which part I reach. Now let's skip to the last movie. So the last movie on the list, once you see that movie, you know at Christmas. They not bring it no other time for the year. Die Hard 1 <laughs> Yo The cast in Die Hard are gone and walk left the TV This is just one movie where Yeah, your virgin them can sit down and watch it I'm not gonna do it every year Just bring the rum If you have a little Chinese virgin like me The name Nick We love watching them video You're gonna need people like him Even we outside a jerk the chicken as in a really business about movie, but the more dead when everybody come together, get one of them friendly. Die Hard with Bruce Willis, and one of the movie them with us. This was started off for Bruce Willis. Right now, I'm coming to some shit movie like I'm thinking of his own studio right now, so I'm just a pump out some movie. I'm coming like Steven Seagal right now, just a pump out some fuckery. But Bruce Willis was like the action hero back in the days. And from part one, two, three, oh yeah, no, take out two. Part three, then four, five, all good movies. But Bruce Willis start in a die hard man actually liking get to learn say he really can't dead. Like in he learn say he might start for the movie and then can't dead. If you watch part four in no business. And Carly came down, the man just get up, knock out the man and take him care. Like, you know, no care at him. We don't even feel sorry for him. He hardly get cut. My cat just go through the window a while ago. I peered at that one, like, may I try to film this thing? About five times now, 
นะฝึกคดสตาร์ทโอเวอร์ด้วยมันน่าที่บลัสสตาร์ทโอเวอร์เนี่ยคริสต์มาสสวัสดีทุกคนวันนี้ผมจะไปเที่ยวในคริสต์มาสปีหน้าผมจะทำให้เป็นนิดหนึ่งที่ดีขึ้นกว่าการเขียนวิดีโอและการเขียนคดเมื่อเขาโพสต์เข้ามาเด็กๆนั่นเป็นทุกอย่างเลยนี่คือมือบลมือบลก็พูดมากมือบลก็คุยกันพูดคุยกันบางอย่างแต่มือบลไม่ได้เป็นธุรกิจบริโภคฉันไม่สามารถเรียกแบล็คอีกแล้วเพราะเขาแค่พูดแค่นั้นแต่ทุกคนทุกคนชอบคริสต์มาสชอบที่จะทำงาน I think when I can check out the movie, I'm gonna just give one. Hopefully, I'm gonna give one a good set of movie. The amount of time I stop and record and start over, I'm not even remember if I did actually put in all of the movie that I made that set. So yo, let me say, Merry Christmas, enjoy on the day.